How to Repair Your Kidneys Naturally Using Baking Soda Very few people are aware that many household chemicals you use in the kitchen have untapped healing properties. One of the most common household items, however, has a potential that is rather difficult to believe. The basic ingredient in baking soda, sodium bicarbonate, has come under increased scrutiny lately because it appears that this chemical has the potential to repair or improve the operation of the human kidney. In 2009, British scientists at the Royal Hospital in London uncovered research that bicarbonate slows the progress of kidney disease. In addition, the U.S. National Health Institute has conducted experiments that show that kidney dialysis using bicarbonate agents have more restorative properties than standard dialysis treatments. It may be hard to accept, but the box you keep in your refrigerator to keep the ham from stinking may also save your life. What Causes Kidney Damage? First, it is important to understand what causes typical kidney damage so you can understand how it is normally treated and how sodium bicarbonate differs from these standard treatments. Your endocrine system produces hormones and enzymes to help digest food into safer chemical your body can process. The pancreas is normally the organ that produces the majority of sodium bicarbonate to protect your kidneys during digestion. Sometimes, even your kidneys will produce additional amounts of this enzyme depending on the type of diet you subject your digestive system to. If your diet puts too much strain on these two organs, especially a diet rife with sugars, fried fatty foods and other unhealthy choices that cause your endocrine system to work overtime in order to process these proteins and sugars, they will both suffer significant reduction in their ability to produce sodium bicarbonate naturally. Without sufficient bicarbonate production to neutralize the acids produced during digestion, these acids can erode organ health, damage your kidneys and speed the aging process in adults. How does bicarbonate repair kidneys? When those with significant kidney damage undergo dialysis or kidney treatment, sodium bicarbonate is one of the most common agents used. This process, known as acid buffering, is means of base supplementation, and is the basis for most new forms of dialysis treatments. This agent, when processed through the dialysis machine, helps in the removal of excess fluids and waste material from your bloodstream. Therefore, dialysis is helping add the sodium bicarbonate that your kidneys can no longer produce into your endocrine system to help you process food and waste materials in your bloodstream. When your body is producing normal amounts of bicarbonate on its own, this can extend the life of your kidneys, your overall endocrine system and your total lifespan. What evidence provides substantial proof of this claim? The U.S. National Health Institute's conducted studies that first noted the effectiveness of sodium bicarbonate dialysis in the place of normal, acetate-free biofiltration dialysis. Patients' place on the SBD treatment had greater nitrate oxide synthase, the process that balances the pH of your blood. Patients on normal acetate-free biofiltration had a lower reaction than BHD in activating vessel wall cells to synthesis-slash-release of pro-inflammatory and pro-apoptotic mediators. Additionally, other studies done by Dr. Ioni D. Brito Ashurst and his colleagues from the Department of Renal Medicine and Transplantation, showed that daily sodium bicarbonate intake slows the progress of chronic kidney disease and prevent patients from ever having to undergo kidney dialysis. This randomized controlled trial showed that patients were given a minor daily dose of SB during a year-long period had only two-thirds of the kidney function decline shown in patients given standard kidney disease treatment. In short, sodium bicarbonate can prevent and in some case reverse the onset of chronic kidney failure and stop related diseases like heart disease and end-stage renal disease. How should you use baking soda to repair your kidneys naturally? Daily sodium bicarbonate intake is not for everyone. It is usually administered in powder form along with water and can be very difficult for sensitive stomach or who are easily prone to nausea to ingest easily. Fortunately, it is not toxic, so anyone who can tolerate the appalling taste and can overcome the initial onset of nausea can take it daily to prevent kidney disease and degeneration of your endocrine system. Properly administering for those in danger of developing kidney disease involves initially includes taking one half teaspoon of SB sublingual, dissolve it under your tongue, on the first day. Next, take one half teaspoon of SB and one half teaspoon of sodium chloride, 
cooking salt, in 1.5 liters of drinking water daily for 2 to 3 days. Then, reduce your daily dosage to 1 fourth teaspoon baking soda and 1 third teaspoon salt. If this still makes you feel sick, then just take the listed amounts of sodium bicarbonate sublingually every day. People should note that there are still some additional tests that need to be conducted to create a complete picture of the benefits that daily sodium bicarbonate intake might produce. However, for those who are serious about repairing the damage that an unhealthy lifestyle or a fat and sugar-rich diet may have caused, household baking soda may be the miracle you have been looking for. Sources, links in description. Dr. Circus. NHS Choices. Health and Love Page. HTTP colon slash slash www.healthanddlovepage.com slash how hyphen to hyphen repair hyphen your hyphen kidneys hyphen naturally hyphen using hyphen baking hyphen soda.